Newton's comprehension of gravity was enough to permit us to travel from the Earth to the Moon. Have you ever been thrown off balance by the endless amount of time spent pondering whether our perception of time is merely the very tip of a huge temporal iceberg? His insight is much more than just a theory. It has been said that it is a key that could open a window into the cosmos mysteries. The universe is much more complex and amazing, inspiring beyond our wildest dreams. The most recent theory by Brian Cox challenges our traditional conceptions of time. What kind of effects could this have on our understanding of the world? Join us on an exciting journey through the passageways of time as we investigate Brian Cox's groundbreaking recent theory about how time works in the universe around us. Many mysteries remain unsolved, and these difficulties involve the fascinating interplay between the two forces fundamental to our existence, time and gravity. We live in a reality in which time moves in unpredictable ways. Additionally, it can speed up or slow down. The force that holds us back from the ground may not be what it appears to be. This is the subject of Einstein's theories of relativity, in which our comprehension of gravity and time takes an unexpected turn. Einstein became a household name by providing us with a new point of view on the universe through his revolutionary theories of relativity. These laid the foundation for the way time works under diverse circumstances, particularly when moving at an extremely rapid speed. The journey began at the turn of the 20th century, when Einstein formulated two groundbreaking theories, the special side that e theory of relativity and the general theory of relativity. The concept of relativity, first published in 1905, revolutionized how we perceive time and space. In simple terms, it claims that the rules of physics hold true for everyone observing, an event, provided they are not accelerating. This theory presents the concept of relativistic effects, incorporating the well-known idea that, under certain conditions, time can slow down. One intriguing thought experiment highlights how time stretches. Imagine a light clock inside a spacecraft, traveling nearly at the speed of light. A beam of light bounces between two mirrors positioned opposite each other in the direction of travel. According to physics, the speed of light is constant for all observers, because the light must now travel. A longer diagonal path, from the perspective of an outside observer, it takes longer to complete its journey. This means the light appears to take more time to reach its destination when viewed from the outside. This difference in perceived time between the two observers is what Einstein defined as time dilation. The moving observer experiences time, more slowly relative to the stationary one. This reveals how phenomena change at high speeds, relativistic effects, which are not just theoretical ideas. Scientists use massive machines like particle accelerators, e.g., the Large Hadron Collider, to accelerate particles to near light speed. At these speeds, we must reconsider how we measure and predict time. Einstein's special theory of relativity, proposed in 1905, transformed our understanding of the universe, especially with respect to motion and time. It challenges preconceived notions, arguing that there is a speed limit. Nothing can move faster than the speed of light. This principle leads to the unexpected conclusion that what seems simultaneous to us may not appear the same to someone moving close to light speed. Related concept is length contraction, which indicates that whenever an object moves at high velocity, it appears shorter in the direction of motion when viewed from a stationary frame of reference. This leads us to Einstein's famous equation, E osh mc2, which demonstrates that mass and energy are interchangeable. This is essential to understanding the behavior of fast-moving subatomic particles and plays a role in nuclear reactions. In fact, special relativity is more than just an abstract theory. It plays a crucial role in everyday technology such as GPS. Signals sent by moving satellites are affected by time dilation. Without accounting for this effect, GPS calculations would be significantly inaccurate. Special relativity teaches us that the passage of time is not absolute. It depends on the motion of the observer. This challenges our everyday understanding of space and time. It suggests that our typical view of the universe might be slightly off, depending on one's frame of reference. In special relativity, time is not fixed. 
it is influenced by motion. Fundamental concepts like the constant speed of light and the mass-energy equivalents have been confirmed by numerous experiments. But there's more. Einstein's general theory of relativity, presented in 1915, delves deeper into the connection between gravity and the structure of the universe. It dismantled the outdated belief that gravity is merely a pulling force between distant objects. Instead, it revealed that mass and energy curve space-time, and that curvature is what we perceive as gravity. Time itself appears to bend or distort in this framework. Gravity is not a mysterious invisible force, but rather a byproduct of how matter interacts with the fabric of space-time. Einstein's general relativity demands a new view of the universe, one with four dimensions, three of space, and one of time. Within this model, massive bodies like stars and planets warp the space-time around them. Imagine space-time as a vast, malleable fabric. When Earth, a heavy object, sits on this fabric, it causes a depression. A smaller object nearby will roll into this depression, just like how celestial bodies are drawn toward each other. This is a simple way to visualize how gravity works in general relativity, a powerful explanation for the motion of celestial bodies in our universe. The solar system, like how the planets move around the sun, also makes it possible for us to accurately predict the paths taken by planets, such as the elliptical orbit of Earth around the sun. Brian says that this view is different from the stale notion that gravity simply brings objects together to form a concept, which has difficulty explaining planetary changes. The new perspective demonstrates that time and space are curved, like flexible fabric, which provides a more precise explanation for the behaviors that were observed. A significant event in the universe that demonstrated general relativity took place during the solar eclipse of 1919. This was led by Sir Arthur Eddington, on a mission to investigate how light from distant stars bent as it got closer to the sun, in accordance with the theory. The mass of the sun ought to cause the light to curve slightly during the eclipse, and the observations were perfectly in line with the predictions made by Einstein. Furthermore, the motion and accuracy of the ore theory modify our perception of time in accordance with gravity. Special relativity also alters the passage of time in areas where gravity is incredibly strong, Time moves more slowly compared to regions with weaker gravitational forces. When you are close to a large object, such as a black hole, your clock would move at a slower rate than one placed farther away. General relativity introduces the idea of regions near black holes where the gravitational forces are so overwhelming that nothing, not even light, can escape. The space around a black Hole is called the event horizon, which denotes the point of no return. Once something reaches this threshold, it is dragged into the red hole from which there is no escape. Einstein's theory of general relativity has significant repercussions for our understanding of the universe. He incorporated a concept known as the cosmological constant into his equations because he believed the universe was static. However, when the universe's expansion was discovered, he later regarded this assumption as an error. Ironically, the general relativity-based view of an expanding universe became fundamental to the Big Bang theory, which explains how the universe started. Another significant idea that comes from general relativity is gravitational waves, ripples in space-time brought about by massive objects moving quickly, such as when two black holes or neutron stars collide. In 2015, scientists from the Laser Interferometer Gravitational Wave Observatory, LIGO, directly detected gravitational waves, providing additional confirmation of Einstein's theory. Despite challenges and alternative theories, general relativity remains the most significant and productive framework for comprehending gravity. It consistently passes tests, from observations of planetary motion to the bending of light around massive bodies and the detection of gravitational waves. Although doubting gravity may appear radical, especially in light of our experience, it is common in science to investigate and reevaluate existing theories. Researchers like Brian Cox challenge established ideas of gravity. Some suggest alternatives, such as MOND, Modified Newtonian Dynamics, which proposes that gravity behaves differently at slower speeds in galaxies, 
removing the need to invoke dark matter. Instead of introducing unknown matter, Mon suggests that gravity becomes stronger at low accelerations. The discussion about gravity also includes the mysterious notions of dark energy and dark matter, introduced to explain specific cosmic phenomena. Critics argue that these concepts may not be necessary, and that alternative theories could provide explanations. Some scientists who disagree with Einstein's gravity are exploring new possibilities, such as unknown forces or particles that could enhance or redefine our understanding of gravity. It is important to note that new scientific ideas are not immediately discarded. They are put through numerous tests and evaluations. For example, Einstein's perspective on time, which includes time travel through four-dimensional space constrained by the speed of light, has inspired exploration into concepts like wormholes and shortcuts through space-time. Stephen Hawking's Chronology Protection Conjecture suggests that traveling back in time might be impossible. But the debate continues. Ongoing experiments and observations continue to test these new theories to determine whether they can explain gravitational phenomena in ways consistent with current knowledge. Although many novel concepts have been proposed, none have yet successfully replaced the well-established laws of gravity. Challenging and questioning existing theories is essential for scientific progress. It leads to a deeper understanding of the universe. For now, general relativity remains the most accepted and effective framework for explaining gravitational theories, despite the challenges it continues to face from alternative ideas.